When the frost is on the pumpkin, this is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by Bill Mosley. When the frost is on the pumpkin, by James Whitcomb Riley, from the Wit and Humor of America, Volume One. LibriVox Coffee Break Collection Number Nine. When the frost is on the pumpkin and the fodder's in the shock, and you hear the kyuk and gobble of the strutting turkey cock, and the clacking of the guineas and the clucking of the hens, and the rooster's hallelujah as he tiptoes on the fence. Oh, it's then's the time a feller is a feelin' at his best, with the rising sun to greet him from a night of gracious rest, as he leaves the house bareheaded and goes out to feed the stock, when the frost is on the pumpkin and the fodder's in the shock. There's something kind of hearty like about the atmosphere when the heat of summer's over and the coolin' fall is here. Of course, we miss the flowers and the blossoms on the trees and the mumble of the humming birds and the buzzin' of the bees, but the air's so appetizing and the landscape through the haze of a crisp and sunny morning of the early autumn days is a picture that no painter has the color to mock when the frost is on the pumpkin and the fodder's in the shock. The husky, rusty rustle of the tassels of the corn and the rasping of the tangled leaves as golden as the morn, the stubble in the furries kind of lonesome-like but still a preaching sermons to us of the barns they growed to fill the straw stack in the matter and the reaper in the shed the hosses in their stalls below the clover overhead oh it sets my heart a clickin like the tickin of a clock when the frost is on the pumpkin and the fodders in the shop End of When the Frost is on the Pumpkin by James Whitcomb Riley Recording by Bill Mosley, Lano County, Texas, USA